Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us in symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. On our channel, we show how all of the world is as a matrix created by God. He has created all of the universe. And everything's going according to the script of the Bible. On June 1st, this month, yesterday, there was this fire near the Vatican. It looked like black smoke was all over the Catholic Church and the Vatican. This is actually a sign of the end times. It actually ended up being a nearby car wrecking yard around the corner from there. This is a sign from God that we're nearing the time of the Revelation 9. And the fifth angel sounded, and I saw a star fall from heaven unto the earth, and to him was given the key of the bottomless pit. And he opened the bottomless pit, and there arose a smoke out of the pit as a smoke of a great furnace. That happened right there, and the smoke was shown all by the Vatican, as if the Vatican had been hit for the grievous head wound they talk of. These signs are of the Antichrist, beast, however you want to talk of him, the false prophet all coming. You can choose who you want it to be, but it's all happening. We show how all of the world is mapped out as a matrix. Here is the Vatican. The incident happened at 115 Via Mattia, Bat Istini. Do you see the bat? The bat represents the beast from the bottomless pit. The Revelation 9 beast. Revelation 9. The smoke out of the pit is coming. The bat. Literally. That's what it means. See, bat. Even this number with 15, we have to keep watch on this month on the 15th. The 15th of each month through the 23rd, there is a lot of symbolism of the end times. See right there? Now, right down here, we will map out the devilish Antichrist figure coming. This one is done upside down, or south is north. See this right here? What is coming is called the beast out of the sea. It will look like a big shark fin. Do you see a big shark fin right there? He will be coming and he will even have this thing to do with a dog. The dog represents the time of the Gentiles and if you have this dog thing you can actually jump between humans. There is your Antichrist guy coming. Your Satan Antichrist what is known as the little horn. Do you see it is mapped out perfectly? There's the dog thing. To catch him, we have to actually get rid of this dog. It has a lot to do with Anubis, and he can pass by the scales and go in and out of different people. He's a spirit. He can go in and out of people. See that there? He's known as the shark, the beast out of the sea, and he will go after the woman, and the reason it's done on these dates 6-1, June 1st, 6-1, and I saw when the Lamb opened one of the seals. This represents the 911 beast and the seals being opened. See here, the white horse, the conqueror is coming. Now we need something to show with a great sword and war, and we need a woman. We need to have that dragon, the beast out of the sea has to go after a woman. See the woman and the dragon? There's the woman. And she will give birth to a child that will be caught up into the throne of God. And she brought forth a man-child who was to rule all nations with a rod of iron. And her child was caught up into God and his throne. Is there anything coming out today that shows about a woman fighting against war in the end times? Yes, right on schedule today. Wonder Woman comes out in the movies. Wonder Woman, representing the Bride of Christ, Israel, and the Great Sword, and she comes to fight Ares' war. Do you see how it's all a stage? The seals are opened. 
the woman is ready to be saved the sword for World War three is coming it's playing out right in front of us there he is that's called your Antichrist little horn it's actually showing her and Chris Jesus defeating him right here see her shield makes her look like she's pregnant and she has the sword and it's ready to kill the little horn right below her you can see the pyramid headed little horn see that is his mouth right there and he's coming after the woman she's ready to kill him as he rises this was shown all over the place it has some things to do with Donald Trump with Obama Russia North Korea China and all the way up to the Pope and even Islam as the New World Order rises see that represents your Wonder Woman character right there see there and we have to get this is coming see the Red Army's coming see the big V like the Vatican everything being hit and then we have to get way over here for the New Age this represents Jesus Christ and he's healing the earth see the earth cracked from a great earthquake coming that's that there this is shown in the new Wonder Woman movie do you see that right there on Paradise Island she protects heaven and heaven has this is the picture of heaven this is Paradise Island do you see the tower right there see the exact same tower with Jesus Christ Jesus Christ protecting the women the woman that's what it's called in the Bible from this thing that wants to kill the woman and kill the child this guy has a lot to do with the Pope also so there you go there's Wonder Woman and that beast is right below her and we had all the signs even the sign of the bat with, with it being on see right here where'd it go 115 via Mattia Battistini the bat is coming the beast from the bottomless pit confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved hallelujah this represents the guy that Wonder Woman is fighting in the movie the bride of Christ Israel thank you very much everybody I'll see you at the wedding feast of the Lamb hallelujah this poster you can make him out perfectly see the woman the bride of Christ from Revelation 12 getting ready to fight the dragon see the sword and right below her is that same thing that is the dragon the little horn like a shark just the, even the Jaws movie represents this see him coming and then the sword out of Jesus Christ's mouth will destroy him as the pits of hell are even opened that is the exact same picture there he is that represents the dragon going after the woman just as we've been showing the same picture thank you very much everybody I'll see you at the wedding feast of the lamb hallelujah I used to want to save the world but the closer you get the more you see the great darkness within. What is your mission? To stop the war. What war? The war to end all wars. I cannot stand by while innocent lives are lost. Be careful, Diana. Who is this woman? She's my um, secretary, sir. <laughs> She's a very good secretary. It is our sacred duty to defend the world. And it's what I'm going to do.